Let's talk about how something as simple as this can make you hundreds, even thousands of dollars every single month in passive income. But here is the best part. You don't even have to write anything in it. We're gonna be talking about how you can make money in your sleep by producing low content books. So if you wanna know more about this, make sure you stick around until the end of this video. What's up, money makers? Welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Diamond Chanel and we talk about all things money. But today is a really exciting video. I'm so excited to share this with you all. It's gonna be very informative and we're gonna be talking about my favorite topic, which is passive income. I just absolutely love any business where you could be sleep and have money coming into your bank account. So I'm going to be showing you how to create low content books and why these are going to be one of the best ways for you to make money with doing the bare minimum. If you're unsure or unfamiliar with the term low content books, it literally just means any type of book, which is usually going to be a notebook, journal, planner, coloring book or any type of activity book that requires little to no writing whatsoever. So let's just get right into the video. If you're not familiar with Amazon KDP, basically it stands for Kindle Direct Publishing and Amazon first started off as a basically an online bookshelf that allowed authors the opportunity to self-publish in a time where self-publishing was kind of looked down on and frowned upon, but now is one of the best ways for people like this person here who makes $450,000 a year, straight passive income from publishing eBooks on the KDP platform. However, this video is not going to be about eBooks. Instead, it's going to be about selling low content books such as this one right here, which is super plain and all that it has in it is a bunch of white blank lines. There are people that are making multiple thousands of dollars per month by literally selling something similar to this. So I'm going to teach you the absolute best ways to have success in your low content KDP books. And I'm going to be showing you some very detailed examples of other people who are doing the same exact thing and that are making a consistent income every single month. So this is going to be a video with a lot of information. And because of that, I went ahead and made sure that I included included some chapters here so that it is easier for you to absorb the information, whether you need to rewatch this video or you need to just go over a specific section over and over again. I have made that easy for you. I'm going to show you how an author such as this person here is making $1,400 every single month in her KDP low content book. And when I mean low content, I mean low content. Just check this out right here. The most effort that she put into this entire thing was in the cover. And literally it just says things that I cannot remember. And it's just a floral pattern cover. But check this out. The interior is literally just blank lined paper. There isn't even a nice back cover. However, she's still making sales every single month. And if you stick with me through this video, we're going to dive a little bit deeper into this particular author. Most effort that she put in was literally for the cover and everything else was extremely plain. In a moment, we're going to go over a platform that shows you the success of other people so that you can replicate the things that they do well and implement that in your own low content book. So I came across this absolutely amazing platform that's called BookBolt. And basically what it is is a third party print on demand website that directly connects to Amazon KDP, which makes it extremely easy for you to not only create your first low content book, but it's also extremely helpful for you to even get started and getting an idea and knowing what is selling and what is not. I mean, this platform is extremely detailed with the amount of sales that other people are making as well as what they are doing right and what they are doing wrong. So we're gonna dive over to BookBolt. But before we get started, I did have some great communication with this company and they gave me a treat to deliver to you all. You get a three day free trial, but not only that, when you use my discount code, that is going to be Diamond Chanel, no spaces, all lowercase, Diamond Chanel as seen right here on the screen. When you use that discount code, you get 
20% off for a lifetime. If you register with Book Bolt before November 30th, you will only pay $49.99 for six months. But the catch is when you use my discount code Diamond Chanel, you will actually only be paying $39.99 per month for six months of access. And that calculates to about $6.50 every month. I really just wanted to share that great deal with you, but nonetheless, whatever package that you sign up for or whatever pricing plan that you sign up for, you will always get your three-day free trial and you will still get the 20% off as long as you use my code. So now let's just jump right into the interface of this platform. I'm extremely excited to show you guys how useful this is. So when you're first logging on, you're gonna register and this is what you're going to see. So this is just a bunch of tutorials and they literally break down every single corner of this website and all of these tutorials and none of which are longer than 12 minutes. So if you had any sort of question or you're trying to maneuver through this website, they literally have all of these resources here for you that takes you step by step on how to create your first low content book. But I'm gonna minimize this into three extremely important steps that you need to take before creating your book. So the first thing that you need to understand is that when we're using Amazon KDP, Amazon is an algorithm. So the success of your book is going to heavily rely on keywords. So this is going to be the great thing that I'm gonna show you how you can break down the most successful people with low content books on Amazon KDP and replicate that so that you make sure that you get sales every single month. The first thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna go over to the research tab here and we're gonna go down to cloud. This is going to be your first step before even thinking about starting your low content book business. This is going to pull up some of the top best sellers in the KDP space. It's gonna show you how much they're making per month, what they've done right, and also what niche and category they're in. And again, it's going to break down their keywords that you need to use to be successful on this platform. So you can you can of course choose the category that you want here and all of these things are going to be low content pieces that you can create within this platform. So right now I'm gonna go over to notebook but you can choose whatever you want. If you're interested in doing music sheets or doing a calendar, a planner, a coloring book, then those are going to be the categories that you wanna look at. So right now let's just do notebook and we're gonna look at the top 100. And we're gonna also, I'm gonna adjust the price range because I don't wanna see any books that are under $5 because we wanna make sure that we have a good profit. And now you can do a keyword search if you already know what niche you wanna get into with your low content books, but because we're just starting off fresh from scratch, I'm gonna leave this blank. So I'm gonna go ahead and click search. And what it does is going to pull up some of the top rated notebooks. So remember this book that I showed you a few minutes ago? We're gonna click on this and see how much the author actually makes in sales. When you look here below, you can see who's published it and obviously they're independently published. You can see the author um, and also all of this other information. But the most important thing we wanna look at here, let's be honest, is how much she's making per month from this one journal. So this particular notebook is making $800 in monthly sales. Let me tell you the trick to making thousands of dollars on this platform. Most authors publish multiple books. Therefore, if she has one book that is making $800 and a second book that is making $800, then she is making $1,600 per month off of two low content books. And again, we can click here and see how low content they are. Not much effort whatsoever. It's literally a cute cover with blank pages. That's it. Now you do have the option for paperback or a hardcover, but she has listed this for just the paperback for five for $5 and 90 cents. Now when you think about it, this is going to be a good price for something that is so minimalistic. I will show you some more creative notebooks and journals, but for right now, we're gonna just look at the most minimalistic one that we could find. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on the author. And when you do this, you're gonna go to a page that says the search seller. So when I then click search, she has 18 low content books that are listed that are making sales every single month. So we can scroll down here and we see this book is making $800 while this one is making $327 per month. This one is making $152 while this one is making $140. Just to calculate her 
four top selling books. We get that she is making approximately $1,400 per month for doing the bare minimum. And please take note, all that she did was change the colors and list them as a totally different book and she's making sales off of it. And she switched up the font a little bit, but that is it. It's kind of the same notebook over and over again. It really is this easy. After you sign up for BookBolt, go ahead and play with the categories a little bit and see what other people are doing and how much they're making. Once you have somewhat of an idea of what kind of low content book you wanna make, you wanna make sure that you niche it down and that you target a specific audience. Why? Because this is gonna ensure that you get more sales. People tend to buy things that they feel is more personalized to them. So therefore, we're gonna go over to keywords because again, keywords are extremely important on Amazon KDP. And we're gonna do a search. If I have decided that I want to start selling low content books that cater towards women, I'm gonna put in the keyword women and click search. This is going to show me the competition. So we wanna make sure that we do have low to medium competition because we wanna show up at the top of Amazon KDP. So for example, if I use the phrase for women, very low competition, which is going to be a good category to go in. I'm gonna take that word for women and I'm gonna head over to products. And this time I'm gonna put general because I wanna see are women going towards notebooks, journals, calendars, planners. So we're just gonna do a general search. This is gonna pull up up to 100 results. So that doesn't mean that this is the only amount. There's probably more, but it's gonna pull up up to 100 results. The lowest book is selling for $4.25, while the highest is selling for $16.99. And so we have an average of about $7.73. And right here, I can get deeper into a niche when I can see a repetitive niche doing well. So here we see a prayer journal for women, which is gonna be 52 week scriptures. And we're gonna go in that in a second. I see a weight loss journal, emotional self care, prayer again, black girl magic, word search, devotionals. So I'm seeing a lot of religious books over and over again that are selling really well. This particular author is offering spiral bound book, which is going to be something like this. And that one is selling for $18.95. So when you're doing a paperback option, you're going to be doing it at a lower cost. But if you do a hard copy, you get to bump up the price a bit. And then if you offer a spiral notebook, you get to really bump up the price. So I would suggest having those three features on there. So let's take a look inside. This person put a lot more effort into it than the last book that we, re that we reviewed. But again, this is extremely simple and extremely easy to create. And if you just stick with me, I'm going to show you exactly how to create your low content books. But we see here that most of the pages are just gonna be continual uh, reflection pages as well as motivational pages. Go ahead and click on the author because I wanna see how much she's making and how many books she has. This author only has two books listed, but she's making $541 for this one book per month. And she's making $322 for the second book per month. So in total, she's making almost $900 per month passive income with a low content book directed to Christian women. Now do not worry if all of that seems a little bit complicated because like I said, they have all of these tutorial videos for you and they're gonna go over exactly what I just went over. So you can always put my video on replay, but you also have these resources here that is gonna show you every single corner of this website. So let's go ahead and jump into the fun part, which is going to be actually creating this low content book. When you're ready to create your book, you will go ahead and click on create. And this is gonna bring up a new menu tab for you. So we're gonna focus more so on the book bulk designer tab. Now this one up here that says Puzzle Wiz is actually for activity books that are a little bit more advanced such as coloring books, crossword puzzles, and so forth. But in order to access that, you do have to upgrade to Pro. Remember to use my discount code Diamond Chanel in order to get your 20% off for a lifetime. But for the sake of this video, we're gonna simply focus on the designer tab. 
once you click on it you will be brought to this page here and so you can see that we have the option of paperback and hard copy but we're going to focus on doing their paperback so make sure that you're doing the cover in a moment we will go over the interior and this is where you're going to pick your dimensions remember your dimensions because they need to be all the same across the board also you do have options for different colored paper but we're going to stick with the basic white and we're going to do 120 pages since the average is actually 110 pages that most people do. So we're going to go ahead and generate this. And now you have your book cover. So on the right side, you're going to see this is going to be the cover. And on the left side, it is going to be the back of the book. Then in the middle, of course, that's where you have the fold. So here are all the colors that you can use for the background of the journal. So you can choose any color that you would like, and um, it has a bunch of different options. You can also go ahead and click on that white tab down there, and you can play and go through different variations. But for the sake of this video, we're going to stick with white, and I'm going to show you uh, different backgrounds that you can use as well. So when we go over to the text, because I'm going to be focusing on basically a Christian based planner. I'm gonna go ahead and choose some text and there are plenty of different variations. There's actually over a thousand fonts that you can use, but I'm gonna choose the one that says Anton. And we're gonna expand it and I'm gonna place it on the cover page, but you can place it anywhere that you would want. So you can add text to the front and the back of your book. I'm gonna go ahead and put in the phrase count your blessings because again, that is going to be centered around Christian women. And you could go ahead and play with the text here. Uh, if you're doing like a longer text, you might have to press enter, enter. And uh, because sometimes the sizing is a little bit difficult for that. So I'm gonna go ahead and size it to my liking. So I'm just gonna place my text here and I wanna show you the different effects that you could do with text. So you can make it bend, you can do like this circle design or you could keep it normal. For the sake of this video, I'm gonna keep it normal and I'm just going to size it to my liking. Make sure that you don't have words that are bleeding over to the back because it's gonna just look a little crazy when it's printed out. So now I wanted to show you this other cool effect that you can do with text. When you go over to the effects tab, you can do uh, some sort of layering, which gives it a more distressed look. So I'm not sure if you guys can see from this video, but you can give it like a white distressed look and it just gives a different edge to your product because of course we want to make sure that the cover is drawing people in. Now, another great feature is you can go over to images and drag any image that you want and place it on your cover page. So I'm gonna remove that distressed effect and I'm gonna actually expand this image that I have here because I want that to be the color and the cover of my notebook. So what you're gonna have to do is click on the text and make sure that you move it forward so that you can get that background to cover the entire thing instead of covering your text. And from there, I'm gonna go ahead and change the color of my text so that it could blend better with the background. But before we do that, I'm gonna show you how you can add an image. So I took this image off of Google. You do not want to get any to any copyright issues, so make sure you have your own images. But all you would have to do is drag it and add it to your book, and you could place it on the front or the back. I'm gonna keep it on the front here, and basically it's gonna be a woman who is praying because, um, like I said, again, our theme is going to be a Christian journal. And then I'm gonna resize my text to make it fit on my journal with the graphic that I have there. And what I'll have to do is bring that front font again to the front and then I'm going to change it up a little bit change up the sizing and change up the spacing so that it can all fit well so now I'm changing the color of my text and all you would have to do is use that little fill icon up there and then you can add in these other shapes or stickers but I want to show you one last feature where I searched up in Google pictures of clouds and what I'm going to do is actually save this image to my computer and then transfer it directly to my journal. 
and what you can do is actually add any image you want and place it within the text so you just have to click on mask and click on what you want it to mask and now i have my font with the picture of clouds in the back so that can just be an another really cool add-on to your design um, but there's going to be so many different things that you can do you probably really want to take your time with this and go ahead and play around with it and also make sure that you look at other people's de designs to see what is drawing others in if you want to know more about how to use this feature again go over to your tutorials and you can do book bolt designer video and this is going to just give you a really in-depth step-by-step um, tutorial on how you can switch up your designs and add graphics so again you'll have that all there for you now the most important part is you need to download your design click download over in the left hand corner and then click download again and what this is going to do is transfer it to your computer and then you can open it as a PDF. This is important because you're gonna to need to download this PDF into KDP when you're uploading your product. And all you have to do, make sure that you save it to your computer. I'm gonna save it under my blessings journal. And later on, make sure that it's easy for you to find. So when you're ready to upload your cover page and your interior, you can do so. Now we can switch over to the interior page and we're gonna go ahead and click on no bleed and I want to do 120 pages. You wanna make sure that all of these dimensions add up. So use the same dimensions that you use for the book for the interior. Then I'll go ahead and click download and this gives me all of my 100 pages. Now if I want to switch it up, I can go ahead and click on music sheet, regular line paper, blank page, or there's all of these great, uh, there's all of these great pages that you can do, monthly to-do list, online shopping tracker, and you really get to choose what you want the inside to look like. Every page could be different. It's all up to you. And I really love this feature that you can customize the interior because you can offer people something uh, more than just blank lines. But instead, I'm gonna just do regular line paper because it's just gonna be a low content, very minimalistic journal. And there I have all of my pages. So then I would download this as a PDF. And when I'm finished with my book cover, I also have to download that. And this is going to be important when you're uploading this product to KDP. So just press save and continue. And from there, all that you're gonna to have to do is go back to those PDFs that you saved on your desktop and upload them into KDP. Everything is already gonna be perfectly sized for you, so all that you have to do is upload it, list it, and then you're ready to make your first sale. All in all, once you use my discount code Diamond Chanel, all that this will cost you is $6 a month. Everything else is free. You can begin making hundreds of dollars, even thousands of dollars every month in straight up passive income by doing the bare minimum, as you saw. All of the links that you need are going to be in my description below. Once you have listed your low content book, that is it that is all that you have to do now you can go ahead and create more and more low content books i do suggest like you saw other authors doing uploading multiple books so that you can see which one is going to hit once you find your winning book you can go ahead and replicate it over and over and over again to increase your monthly sales the best thing about amazon is they do every part for you you went ahead and you created a digital notebook journal planner or activity book and they make it a book they keep the inventory they do the shipping they handle customer service and the best part of all they do most of the marketing for you if you made it to the end and you enjoyed this content please be sure to like comment and subscribe i always tell you guys to go ahead and leave me your favorite emoji in the comment section because this just lets me know that you're listening and i try to reply to as many people as i can so go ahead leave me a smiley face give me a thumbs up give me a heart or, or just give me your favorite emoji but before you go, make sure you check out these two videos because they're gonna show you some more ways to make money. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next one.